Good morning, everyone. This is Bill Zeltman coming to you today with our training from the uh, Town Guru's Really Daily Dish. And what I want to talk with you about today, uh, again, is prospecting for success, ways and places to find more listings. Where do you go to find people that are looking to sell their house? So I've given you nine ways so far. Uh, this series has 17 ways. There are 18 videos in it. You can go back and review the videos on our Facebook group. Uh, they're all there if you want to review them. Also, all this training is, is um, in our Step Ahead Training Academy. So all of our realtors, you just go in, you know, you're all enrolled automatically uh, just for working here. It's all free of charge. As I said, you can go in, not only find uh, these 17 ways to, to find prospects, but find so much else. And you're going to find worksheets for these. So you can actually go out and it'll teach you how to implement each of the things that, that we're talking about uh, in this program. So uh, today, number 10, is using for rent by owners. Now this is fantastic if you're down near the shore. Uh, so for our Jersey Shore people, South Jersey Shore, you know, wherever you are, um, and you know, you guys, there's a lot of you. Um, what a great way to, uh, to find new listings, and that's to get in touch with for rent by owners. This also, though, works in other areas for our, our uh, people that are up closer to our Marlton office uh, that are working up uh, Cherry Hill area near Philadelphia. This works for you as well because for rent by owners are people that own a rental property. And trust me, you're, if you call enough of these people and they're easy to find because their phone numbers are out there looking for tenants all the time, especially the shore, shore ones, they're in um, for, you know, for rent by owner, uh, they're, they're, they're all over the internet. You just go and do a search form, you'll find them. You're going to find that these people are in search of, and, and one of the things, by the way, is when you call them, say, look, I've got people that look to rent here every year. Do you pay a broker's commission? And they might say to you, yeah, I have open listings, and you can get an open listing out of this, which is fantastic because you get the rent, you know, you can, you can get a rent, little bit of a rental business going. But beyond that, and where we really want to make our money is we want to stay in touch with these people. So we get them to rent, we get them to list with you for the rental, um, or we get them in the spot we really want them, which is they're frustrated because they've had this place for a while. Maybe they're making money, maybe they're not, but it's it's been a headache, um, and they're ready to sell. Uh, and that's the ones we're looking for. Um, and sometimes by just saying, hey, man, you know your place is like doubled in, in, in value since you've owned it? You know, yeah, I know you're making, you know, a couple hundred bucks a month in the rent, but you could really, uh, you know, make a huge killing right now just by selling the place. And you could turn around and get two or maybe three uh, rentals. And instead of making $300 a month, you could make $900 a month. So there's all kinds of ways of conversations you can have with these people. Um, but what you'll find when you talk to people that are renting properties is that many people are frustrated and they're frustrated for too many reasons for me to even discuss and they really don't matter. All you want to do is get to what we always teach, what it is they're committed to and they may very well be to the point where they're they're ready to commit to sell this property. So um, again, you could find people that you just get an open listing to rent. The strategy with them is this, you continue to call them quarterly to ask for updates, make sure there's availability and stay in touch with them. That way, when the time comes that they are ready to sell, or maybe they want to buy another property because they're doing so well, either way, um, they're going to go to you because the other people they may have an open listing with probably only get in touch with them once a year, if even that. You're going to call them not just to find out what's going on with their property, but to give them a little bit of information about what's happening in the local area. Sending the newsletter out that has local events or, or, or what's going on in the real estate market um, helps with that. And then having the conversation going through saying, hey, you know what, uh, how about we do a free market evaluation and we see where your investment is right now as far as from a value of the property standpoint. So all these th ways of talking to for rent by owners are a great way to build relationships and to find prospects. And you know what the beauty is, especially for you people at the shore, many of these rental properties, these are million dollar listings. Uh, if not, they're six, seven, eight hundred thousand dollar listings. These are these are bigger ticket items. So work these relationships, get to know these people, and remember that these people have friends. Some of them, this might be a way of, of finding buyers too, where they say, you know, my friend keep I, my friend keeps looking at what I'm doing down here. He's interested in buying uh, some investment properties. Well, guess what? These are the types of buyers you want. Uh, so I know we're talking about listings here, but this is a byproduct of this. 
forge these relationships, get these people to know you, trust you, make a relationship with them. And not only will they give you, you know, they provide you business when they need you, uh, but they also have friends uh, that are also hopefully very wealthy and are, are looking for good investments. And you can be that realtor for them. So thanks for joining. Uh, today, our number 10 was for rent by owner. Uh, try this out as you add your extra hour each day um, through these 30 days of, uh, of the um, listing challenge that we put that we set out in front of you. And we will talk to you again tomorrow. Thanks. Have a great day.